be a friendly place to, you know, to sit and have breakfast, and you never let your cup get empty. Yeah, you can see that the cups are. Yeah, I took a, I took a look at the menu. The, the cups are the, the cups, cups are pretty cups good. Are pretty big, yeah, the cups, cups are pretty big. good. So we like the food, and then you know we the other thing too is you get used you get used to it. So you you compare it to other plate. You know, you go somewhere else and you compare it. But I think he's got the best breakfast sausage patties around. They're very good. Uh, his meats are, are, are pretty good. Uh, Joanna loves his sausage gravy, which he made as a special today. Uh, the Stemmy's omelet is, if you like a lot of meat, I mean, on a special day, I'll order the Stemmy's omelet. It's it's really, really good. So what's the specialty of Stemmy's? Stemmy's omelet, probably, and the bananas. And the French toast. The steak and eggs. Oh, oh, yeah. What's it like working in close quarters with your, your husband all day? Not good. That's not true. Yeah, I'm being honest. You know I mean, after a while of working together. Get him to be serious. And I'm serious. And it looks like you're making hash browns on the back. It's really thin and, and crispy. Yeah. The breakfast showdown paid a visit today along Route 611 south of Easton in Williams Township. We stopped at Stemmy's Place, uh, probably the oldest location in our breakfast showdown, originally constructed in 1773. Also the most unusual, a lot of personality in this place. Uh, we had a lot of fun, the food was good. Kelly, what are you going to remember about it? Well, I'm just thankful that we got out of here without a ghost sighting. I was a little worried when they started telling us all the ghost stories. Um, but the food really hit the spot. They had, I had buttermilk biscuits with a nice homemade sausage gravy that really, really hit the spot. Um, but once you get the owners going, it's like part restaurant, part comedy club. I mean, you could have a ball in here. It's a quirky place, but definitely worth a visit. We had breakfast uh, nearby a carousel horse and a disco ball inside of the bar. But it was uh, a pleasant visit. We had a lot of fun. The food was good. I went with the breakfast bonanza, some French toast, a little bit of eggs, sausage. Executive producer Bill Adams raved about the scrapple, probably the best scrapple visit we've had. Uh, so far in the last seven weeks. I know you're sad. We're going to be wrapping up the breakfast showdown later this week. Uh, we'll be at the Key City Diner along Route 22 in Low Pacon Township, New Jersey. That's right outside of Phillipsburg. Uh, should be a nice visit there. You can check out all of our reviews. You can see our videos. You can see some of the other spots we visited. Check out our photo galleries all at lehighvalleylive.com slash breakfast showdown. Also look for us on RCN TV. Also check out our reviews on Wednesdays in the Express Times.